get to fit? 45. Good job. Yeah. Good morning, every peoples. It is my first track day, and you know what? Considering the fact it's my first time, this is a pretty sweet setup. So I'm with my friend Morgan and his friend Joe, and we got his canopy set up. Got my stuff. Got his stuff. Got his stuff. We're all here in this little cute section. This is day three of my three-week trip. Past two days have been driving here from Maryland to here, and now we're in Topeka, Kansas, at the Heartland Motor Park. And uh, in 20 minutes, we gotta go in for class time. <laughs> you gotta hold it up and you gotta cradle it, like left to right. There, there, child. <laughs> Perfect. It'll be just fine. <laughs> See you at class. It's school time. I'm going to school on a weekend. There's a lot of R6s and surprisingly a lot of Groms here. We're keeping a lot of the equipment as we consolidated the servicing my vintage bikes. But uh, you want any equipment? I've got an extra TIG welder. Glasses yeah. over. And now all of us noobs are going to go onto the catwalk out there so we can watch Morgan go by. Obviously, always the most important thing. Is yeah, we're not hurt. Hopefully, the bike's okay too, and we can get him back out there for the rest of the day. We'll just have to uh, we'll just have to see when it gets back. All right, well, time for the gross process of big guy, little coat. You know that big guy, little coat. It's gonna be me. Bad news is big guy, little coat. The good news is I have a brand new custom fitted suit by Forza Canada, who are sponsoring this video, because they said they asked if I wanted a suit, I said, well, actually, I'm gonna do a track day, so yeah, I'll totally take one. So they made this for me, but I might just not record me trying to put it on, because that's not pleasant for anybody. I don't care who you are, except maybe Morgan. That's it. You're in, dude. I was just explaining to Walter what the traditions are with the new suit, and it's a good luck thing. You gotta take your new suit and roll around on the ground, so it's already scuffed up, so you don't have to crash and scuff it up. Okay. So he's gonna do that. All right, here we go. Let's see it. There it is. Yeah, woo! Oh yeah, get dirty. That's good. That's real good. That's what I'm talking about. It's comfortable. It's not bad, ground, right? Yeah. Not incentive enough for you to crash the <laughs> <laughs> It's funny. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks. You've done well. Thanks, Coach. Walter, what it's are you a, laying on the ground for? Big boy like you. Coach told me to do it. Both side of the carousel. Dude, come on, man. Every shame. Every, uh, come on. Every time. You weren't recording, were you? No. I, you know how I knew that? How? Because you crashed. Yes. That's one of my rules. As soon as you don't record, you record. something bad happens. Well, I'm glad you're okay. I heard you went down. I was like, oh my gosh. And yeah. he's like, no, he's fine. He's just, I was yeah, like, well, he's probably upset. He's probably upset okay. at least. Oh. Yeah, I am. <laughs> this thing's done for the summer. That's a clip okay. on. We got it out of the way. Two first one's done. Both clip ons and the right side. I was like, no. Did you see me go down? You, you slid all the way across the carousel, dude. Yeah. I can get started on the Craigslist ad. All right. Lightly used. Yeah, lightly used. Low miles. Clean title. Over. Okay, apparently it's time for me to go. Yep. So, uh, do you think I'm ready to go? Ready, dude. Okay, I'm gonna have GoPro oh, on up. and uh, you'll just see my first time on the track. Alrighty, thank you. See you guys. I'll be safe. Bye, mom. All right, cool. They're just taking off. I guess I'm just going. Hi, everybody. All right, turn this warning off. I know my tire pressure is low. Whew. Ooh, that air feels good. Oh boy, buddy. All right, I'm gonna drive like such a good piggy. I've never been on this track before. I guess I'm gonna follow this coach. 
no use of looking over my shoulder and signaling if I'm not supposed to. Oh my goodness, look at this. I was not instructed on proper leaning or any kind of techniques at all. I'm literally, I keep checking over my shoulder. I'm literally just being thrown onto this track with a novice group. So I know track rules and novice group rider rules. It's very important for me to not crash. Oof, very important. I keep wanting to check over my shoulder, but I, I gotta not do that. Novice rules include no passing in the turn. So right now I should, I, there's no reason for me to check over my shoulder. The bike has been modded, more powerful airbox. Not in track mode, because I don't trust myself. I wouldn't try that yet. I should follow the line. I'm used to not being directly behind somebody, you know? I, I ride staggered. So the track, track etiquette and rules are all completely different. All you track guys who are watching this video to critique me, go ahead. I'm here to learn, also for the experience. In all the seven plus years I've been riding, I've never been bothered to do a track day. One of the reasons for that is because I couldn't justify taking one of my other bikes to a track. Yeah, the R6 would have been capable. Kind of regret not doing it, but I was like, I'll tell you what though, when I have a bike that's over a thousand, I won't have an excuse and I'll go then. So now I have this bike and I was like, well, now I gotta go. So here I am and it's worth it just for the experience. You know, this suit is not bad now that I'm on the bike. I've only been wearing it while, uh, what's the word? While upright, so that wasn't too great, but um, this is totally fine. I'm actually fairly comfortable. <laughs> it's my own custom suit. Feels special. I don't want to sound like an impatient, incompetent person, but I'm ready to go faster. But I'll be a good piggy. I'll just hang out. Oh, I just remembered. This is the first novice ride, which means no passing. Okay. I'm glad I remember that just now. I'm glad my feeling earlier of, I don't feel like I'm allowed to pass was right. I'm not supposed to pass. This first 20 minute novice session is literally a lead ride where you just learn the track a little bit. Well, that's a fun turn. Oof. More fun if you stay on the road though, I'm sure. We're only going 75. Ha 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 Laughable. Woo! The bike wants to go, bro. Oh, another crash. Okay. Where's the yellow flag? There it is. Well, there should be a yellow flag out here. Just sitting on the bike. Means he's okay, waving. All right, cool. All right, cool. You're all right. All right, cool. We're all going up. Okay, so check us out. We're leaving the track right now, and then we just get to go to our little tents. And we're really close by. So there's some guys, VIPs, I'm guessing, special people. And we're right, oops, no turn signal. <laughs> I'm used to signaling all the time. Right up here. All right. 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 It's good, dude. I don't think we went faster than maybe 80. Someone else crashed too. Yep. You think it's gonna drive again today? Yep. Nice. We'll get it going. All right, I'm gonna take my helmet off. And uh, this video is unlike most videos, it uses the GoPro and that camera, but let's just get some more footage throughout the day. All right. All right, just got off the bike as you saw for the first novice session. You got everything you need? Yeah. Sounds like this bike is gonna get on the track again today. Oh, big problem now. Well, I'm getting ready to go for my second time, and apparently somebody wrecked again. Not a big surprise. There's the crash guy. Let's go that he gets to ride on the bike as it's being towed. Looks like an FZ09. Or, yeah, that's what it looks like. Yay! Freedom! We're gonna get ready for freedom! Whew, the air feels good, bro. Oh! Touched my toe on the ground. I did not do a good job on that turn. Okay. Woo! It's the only other straightaway I know about. Oof. I really feel that low tire pressure working for me. Trying to keep up with coach. Okay, gas time. Woo! Okay, 130. My toe! Ah! I'm really shy when it comes to turns. I do not commit. I do not put my knee down. I don't lean off the bike. I just don't trust me. So I was shy in the turns. Oh, toe. My toe scraped the ground and I was like, I feel like I'm about to, and then boom. Come on, we gotta break 130. Nope, didn't make it. 
I'm close though. All right, next time I'm passing somebody, next straight I'm gonna pass. Oh, 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 oh. These two turns, man. I just am awful and I'm acutely aware of how awful I am right here on these turns, these last three. I can feel, ugh. Oh, okay. because I took my hand off the bar to move that camera like I just did again. And then I second guessed my braking. And then uh, traction control saved my butt. They probably would have just whoop, slipped out below me. So that was a little, that was an, a butt pucker moment. It's about as fast as I really wanted to get a new top speed. But might have to wait for a traction. Another bike is down. A bike went down here earlier. I just got back from the second the second session and I, I think I pushed myself about as far as I think I'm gonna go without me without learning more so that was pretty I guess good there's three turns that I just can't do and then like my max speed is 130 which I'm honestly disappointed in myself I thought I could get faster than that there's one reason for it, like a blind hill that I'm too scared to accelerate over, but I really can only think of one thing I want to do and that's get followed by a coach next session. I'll be out for a little while. I'm having a migraine. I get really bad migraines. Now I'm catching one, so I'm going to be out for a couple of That sucks. I know. I'm mostly bummed about you. I know, Alright, so unfortunately, Morgan succumbed to his super bad migraine. So, we want to make sure he's okay. We're going to try to get him home. He's, he's doing pretty bad, so we're gonna get him out of here. And we're gonna be done for the day. So I was trying to load, trying to help load his motorcycle. I was a goddamn genius. Got a little boo-boo? It's a little one. And then, this is what's so stupid about it. I injured myself. I'm gonna put some napkins and tape and I'll just wrap this up. Came back to help. Did the exact same thing again, right there. And he's having a good old Whoops. time. So now the misfortune befell all of us. Well, give me one of these. There. <laughs> it was it was cool to meet you. I mean, me because, too, because this was only a few hours, I'll have to come back oh, yeah. next year. Well, it's too bad today was cut short. Um, I got a little cut there. Probably should cover that with something. And then this one's a big cut. It said I don't need stitches because I got pressure on it soon enough. And I was like, yeah, electrical tape came through. So it was a good track day. It was a good first experience. I will say I do need another track day because one, I want to, and two, I don't feel like I got the full experience. It was just three sessions. So it's cool, but I got to do it again. So thanks again to Forza Canada for making that suit for me. If you're interested in any of their suits, check out the description for a website link. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.